Dok, ang sabi lang sa akin, kumain ka ng kalabasa. Yan daw magpapalinaw ng mata ko. Papalinaw ng yes. mata. They actually don't improve your vision. Totoo ba na kapag daw natulog ka, nabasa yung buho, yan. Yan. Oh, oh. lumalabo yung mata? Hindi naman. Hindi naman siya totoo. Director, po pa-adjust ng konti kasi parang malabo. Ayan, nako ha, ang hirap talaga pag malabo ang mata because you know, we don't see as well as we used to because as we age, eye problems get in the way of our daily activities, including work. According to a 2018 survey, vision impairment and blindness rank among the major concerns in the country with a current prevalence rate of 1.98% or 1.11 million Filipino-specific eye disorders. In fact, there are over 4 million Filipinos living with undiagnosed eye problems that need to be addressed. And these conditions may not be entirely genetic. Today, as we celebrate Independence Day, we will be talking about the different causes of poor vision and at the same time, the things that we can do to be finally free and independent of glasses and contact lenses. My name is Apple David and joining us today is Dr. Alex Gonzalez an ophthalmologist here at Shinagawa LASIK and Aesthetic Center. Uh, hello everyone, uh, thank you for having me here today at Shinagawa team. Also with us is Ms. Sanya Lopez, aka Yaya Melody, and ang first Yaya on GMA. Hello po, hello po sa lahat ng nanonood ng Shinagawa TV. Sana po ay marami kayong matutunan today. So Dr. Alex and Sanya, for today, pag-uusapan natin the causes, the triggers of poor vision, our experiences of having poor vision, and at the same time, the treatment and management for it. So Doc, alam mo, marami ang nakaka-experience ng poor vision, eye problems. But when we say someone is having a poor vision or an eye problem, what does it exactly mean? Well, vision problems, no? it's a very general term. No? So it means there is a decreased vision. No? There are different types kasi, no, of vision problems. It could be distance, mm -hmm. or it could be near, or it could be a combination. So those are the vision problems that we encounter daily. Mm -hmm. Then, Doc, when we say kasi na eye problem, it's mm -hmm. not only about poor eyesight. Yeah. Ano pa po ba yung iba't ibang eye conditions na pwede ma-experience or maranasan ng isang tao? Well, it differs, no? For children, the most common ones are error of refraction or yung malabo yung mata. Mm -hmm. May mga duling or banlag or strabismus. Mm -hmm. And also yung lazy eye or amblyopia. For adults naman, no? iba rin yung most common vision problems ng adults. No? One of which is refractive error or malabong mata. Pangalawa, cataract or katarata, glaucoma, or those with uh, diabetes uh, na may tinatawag tayong sakit dyan na retinopathy or mm -hmm. diabetic retinopathy. So there are so many different vision problems no? that each age group no? differs talaga. Mm -hmm. Actually, in the Philippines, no? around 2 million no, has mild to moderate visual impairment. Half a million of which are already blind. Mm -hmm. no? So imagine the burden no, of illness, no, of the vision impairment, vision problems. And there are so many risk factors no, that can affect no, our eye health. No? One of which is, of course, aging. Mm -hmm. Another thing, our lifestyle, if you smoke, no, you drink alcohol, mm -hmm. no? pangatlo, our work, no? it also affects it. No? If we use computers too much, especially right now, no, pandemic tayo, iba na yung setup natin, no? Totally agree with you kasi yeah. doc, sa family namin, tatlo kami ah. yung merong vision problems. And mm -hmm. Sanya, yes. how about you? Ako rin, Dok, eh. Kasi okay. before, actually, yan yung nagiging problem ko. Lalo na sa, sa aming mga actress. Mm -hmm. um, nangyayari kasi kapag meron kami ka-eksena, ang labo na. So, uh -huh. nahihinapan talaga kami. And nasanay ako na before, kailangan naka-contact lens. Yeah. Mahirap din kasi may mga time, like for example, meron kayong pahinga, mm -hmm. hindi ka makapagpahinga talaga kasi suot mo yung contact lens mo. Yeah. Oh, oh. Yung mga Actually, yun yung mahirap para sa akin talaga. Yeah. Kasi, for sure. like for example, may in-instruct si Direk na dito yung pwesto ko and then sobrang layo nung ka-eksena na makikita ko lang kung ano nangyayari. Mm -hmm. Sobrang hirap para sa akin kasi nakaka-affect pa rin yun sa acting. Mm -hmm. Actually, nung bata ako, Medyo maaga nga akong nag-start ng ano, eh, pagkalabo ng mata kasi 
um, pag nag-aaral ako before, ganito na ako. So, lagi akong ganun lang mag-aaral. So, anong age ka na nag-start? Mga 8 years old daw. Ah, 8 years old. Okay. Ganun. Mm -hmm. Palang medyo malabo na yung mata ko. Pero sa amin, sa family ko naman, ako lang ang malabo yung mata. So, ganun yung nangyari sa akin. And kapag nanonood ako, like, mahilig akong manood sa harapan ng Malapit. TV. Malapit. <laughs> Gusto ko parang nanonood ako sa sinihan lagi. Ganun. Now, ano yung ginawa mo back then, no? To remedy itong poor vision? Lagi na lang ako nagsasalamin. So, lagi rin ako nag... Importante talaga ang check-up. Mm -hmm. So, lagi ko inaalam kung ano yung grade ko, kung tama pa ba yung salamin na sinusuot ko. And, of course, yung contact lens din. At uh, yun nga, kailangan laging maliwanag sa akin. And kung saan ko lang nilagay yung gamit ko, dapat dandun lang. Kasi mm -hmm. minsan, hindi ko na nakikita eh, yung mga bagay. So, kailangan kung saan ko iniwan, dapat nandun siya. Para hindi na ako mahirapan, mapabilis din yung trabaho. But Dok, na banggit yeah. ni Sanya kanina, siya ina-adjust niya sa bahay nila mm -hmm. na as much as possible, maliwanag lahat. So, is it also important na yung bahay mo or your environment, you kind of make it adapt? You yeah. itaas ang lighting or do you have to put labels, markings na nandito to, nandito yan? Well, one of the things that we should do no, as a person no, is to make sure that we are comfortable. No? Mm -hmm. Number one yun. So, it's the same with your vision. No? You have to make sure that you are comfortable vision-wise. No? So, ano ba yung mga pwede natin gawin to make us feel more comfortable in our vision? No? One, if we feel tired, we rest. Mm -hmm. Simple as that. No? Uh, may technique kaming tinuturo sa mga patients namin. It's called 20-20-20 rule. Mm -hmm. So, after you know, hard day's work, you can use that. No? Uh, after 20 minutes of work, when you read or when you drive, you rest you look mm -hmm. for 20 seconds, uh, for about 20 seconds, and then you look 20 feet away. No? Mas maganda kong greens, mm -hmm. no? mga plants, and then it will refresh your eyes. Pangalawa, you can use artificial tears. No? It lubricates your eye. No? Pangatlo, you can also use matte filters. No? So it's a technique that I always use no? sa cellphone ko, sa computers, mm -hmm. to just decrease the contrast. And mm -hmm. also, May mga iba nagsasabi, they use humidifiers. Meron ba kayo nun sa bahay, humidifier? Yeah. Yeah. So, yung humidifier na yan, it increases the moisture no, of the air. So, medyo lesser yung dry ice na mm -hmm. nangyayari. So, yun yung mga pwede natin gawin. No? But, of course, no, we can only do so much. Mm -hmm. no? Of course, what we need to do is to go to the problem itself. Doc, Sanya, alam nyo mukhang maraming nakaka-relate ta sa atin na viewers. So we have uh, some questions coming in in our social media accounts. This one from Facebook. Doc, yeah, sure. I am 33 and mm -hmm. I tend to stay up late working in front of a computer. Wow. But I haven't felt any vision problems yet. Wow. Is this normal? Or even if you don't experience any vision problems, do you need to get your eyes checked? Well, Una, no? ang ganda nga ng situation niya. No? Wala siya nagiging problem. So, mm -hmm. I guess that's a good thing. No? Mm -hmm. At that age, no? even if we work too much. No? Swerte nga nung, ano, eh, nung nag-message. No? Sana all. Oh, oh, sana, oh, all. Oh, oh, sana all. Sana all. Sana Pero yun nga, even if we are normal, no? it is still very important that we have our eyes checked no? for young adults, no? 18 and above. At least every two or three years, kailangan magpa-check. Mm -hmm. Just to make sure that everything is okay. Parang wala, wala tayong ma-miss na problems. Because mm -hmm. again, no, there's so many no, eye problems that are preventable and treatable. Mm -hmm. So, hanggang maaga pa, kung madetect natin, much better. Tsaka mm -hmm. sabi nga nila, di ba, lagi, prevention is better than cure. Okay. So, Doc, we have another question also Wait, from sure. Facebook. Is it healthy to use the same pair of glasses throughout the years? Ito bang Facebook na ito? Mga kamag-anak ko ba yan? <laughs> Puro sila na nagtatanong. Anyway, uh, yung glasses, no? Kung okay lang na suotin. Well, one thing, no? Um, if you have prescription glasses, no? The first thing that you should consider is, again, comfort, no? Ano ba? Comfortable ka ba doon, no? Iba-iba kasi yung tao na may iba. Uh, Nag-iiba yung grado nila every one or two years. May iba as fast as six months. Ikaw ba sanya? Yung glasses mo, yearly ka ba nagpapalit? Yearly. Mm -hmm. yearly. So again, I'll reiterate the importance no, of having your eyes checked. Mm -hmm. 
and doc, correct me if I'm yeah, wrong, sure. na yung prescription glasses na yan is just one of the things we can do Absolutely. as treatment or a remedy sa poor vision. But the good thing is mm. that we now have a technology that can actually solve itong poor vision na mas long term. Yeah, right? I agree with that. Yeah. And yan ang pag-uusapan natin plus more. Dito lang po kayo magbabalik ang Shinagawa TV. The Shinagawa LASIK and Aesthetic Center can give you a clearer life that you've always been dreaming of. Vision changes normally happen to many people as they grow older, but you may not notice any change until around age 40. Welcome back to Chinagawa TV and still with us is Doc Alex Gonzalez and Ms. Sanya Lopez and this time we will be talking about eye problems or vision problems in particular and kung paano nga ba natin to ititreat at yeah. manage. So Doc, ano ba yung common misconceptions when it comes to eye care? Okay, so kayo ba guys? No? Question lang for mm -hmm. the both of you. Meron ba kayong mga parang ginagawa ng mga parents nyo na sinasabi na this will improve your vision? May mga ganun bang mm -hmm. instances? Ah, ako, Dok, ang sabi lang sa akin, kumain ka ng kalabasa. Mm. Yan daw magpapalinaw ng mata ko. Magpapalinaw ng yes. mata. Yeah. Kumain ka ng kalabasa at kumain ka ng carrots. Yes. Sabi yes. nila, yung mga makukulay, kamatis yan. Yes. Totoo ba to, Dok? So, Ikaw, Dok, Dok, totoo well, ba to? actually, carrots and, you know, mga kalabasa, they actually don't improve your vision. Ay, no, it mali ang magulang natin. Oh, oh, so, sabi ko na nga, it pa, doesn't improve your vision. But, you know, these are foods rich in vitamin E. No? Mm -hmm. So, vitamin A is an essential component for our body, no? And also our eye health. Mm -hmm. But it never improves your vision. But Doc, ang dami kasi na bata pa lang, mm -hmm. naka-experience na yung labo ng mata. Oh, oh. But the, is there a certain age na kailangan, okay, when you reach this age, mm -hmm. magpa-check ka na, madiagnose na yan. How early should an, a vision problem be detected? As early as you were born. No? Oh. Actually, oh, oh. Kailangan pag panganak pa lang ng bata, no? Masi-screen na siya, no? For mm -hmm. different eye diseases. And then after that, six months old, then three years old, school age years, no? Pagpasok sa school, very important yan. Kasi by seven years old, no? Very important na yung vision natin should be normal. Mm -hmm. Dapat 20-20 vision. Okay? Kailangan ma-achieve natin yan. Kung glasses man yung susutin mo, contact lens or operation, important na 2020. Because if you don't achieve 2020 by 7 years old, you will have what we call lazy eye or amblyopia. It means that kahit anong glasses, contact lens, or even surgery, hindi ka makorekt to normal vision or 2020. Mm -hmm. Ikaw, Sanya, kailan mo ba na-experience na, ay, medyo malabo pala yung mata ko or lumalabo na yung mata mo? Yeah. At the age of 8. No? Uh, 8. Lalo na magpas po ako sa 7. Medyo. Paano kaya yun doon? <laughs> <laughs> Pero ganun, parang kasi matangkad ako. So, doon ako sa likod. Mm -hmm. so, tapos nahihirapan na akong tingnan yung blackboard namin. Parang lagi ako nagaganan doon. Nag-squint ng eyes. Ang naaalala ko nung ako, um, I think I was... 10 years old okay, naman, naman, nung na vision problem na na-feel ko na, yung itatanong ka, di ba, pag seating arrangement sa school, okay. tapos bandang nasa gitna, kasi D yung apelido ko, so medyo gitna, pero itatanong ng teacher, sino dito yung nahihirapan makita yung sulat sa board? Mm -hmm. So, ililipat nila sa medyo harap. Harapan. Yun, madalas na ako nauupo sa harap nun. Ikaw oh. din ba, safe? May, mahihain kasi ako ng bata ako, so hindi ako nagkaroon ng chance na magtaas ng kabay lagi. Dapat, unless alam ko yung sagot, gano'n uh -huh. na gano. Pero minsan nahihiya rin ako sa mga classmates ko kasi mm -hmm. nga matangkad ako. Tapos nagre-reklamo kasi. So, uh -huh. ako talaga yung lagi nag a So, sige, alikod na lang ako. Tapos, kung ano yung sinusulat ng katabi ko, yun na lang. Buti, nakikita mo pa yung sinusulat ng katabi mo. Kasi hindi pa siya gano'n kalala. Okay. Kay Sanya na mismo nang galing na hindi siya comfortable to speak, no? To speak her mind na may vision problem na siya. That's why, again, no? I'm reiterating to our audience, no? Eye screening, no? Eye checkup is very important. And kung magulang ka, no? And you see your kids, no? You observe them, no? Check mo if uh, lumalapit sila sa TV. Mm -hmm. How are they doing in school? Kasi good vision also equates to uh, grades in school, no? So kung medyo poor yung performance, 
baka malabo yung mata. Pero doon ako may question ako. Yeah. Sure, oh, Kasi yung mommy ko, lagi niya ako pinagbabawalan like after school, mm-hmm. maligo, okay. tapos matutulog. Mm-hmm. Totoo ba na kapag doon natulog ka, nabasa yung buho, yan, 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 oh, oh. lumalabo yung mata? Hindi naman. Hindi naman siya totoo. Actually, it's very good na pinali- dapat maligo tayong lahat, no? especially <laughs> ngayong pandemic. No? Mm-hmm. So, mga mothers dyan, hindi po totoo yun. Mm-hmm. Uh, kailangan Hygiene is very important. Yes. Importante lang na siyempre tuyo yung ating ulo o mm-hmm. basa kapag natulog. So walang effect no, sa vision yung maligo and then matulog. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I believe no, to start, a lot of people talaga, they resort to glasses. Yeah. Lalo yung mga bata. Mm-hmm. But then Sanya, you know, as we grow older and lalo sa trabaho natin, we're always in front of the camera. Kailan mo or what made you decide na sige, I need laser, I need a treatment that's really long term na mas less hassle talaga? Actually, na-discover ko siya doon sa isa kong katrabaho, si Pancho Magno, na dito rin nagpalisik sa Shinagawa and uh, sinabi niya sa akin na as in life changing to. Mm-hmm. Tapos, uh, sabi ko sa kanya, sige, gusto kong malaman kung paano ba yan, masakit ba, kung paano yung procedure. And then, sinabi niya sa akin ng as in, walang kasakit-sakit. Doon ako naging interesado lalo kasi sobrang ang lakas ng tulong nito eh, for me na hindi na ako mahihirap ang makita yung malayo kung paano mag-instruct sa direct mm-hmm. and napapabilis lahat ng trabaho. And then sabi ko, kailangan ko to. Ang nagpatagal lang siguro talaga sa akin is yung schedule lang talaga. Pero yes. hanggat kaya nyo talaga, subukan nyo na talaga magpasinagawang pagpalaisik na talaga kayo. Mm-hmm. And since we're already talking about LASIK surgery, Doc, please help us, help the viewers understand what exactly is LASIK surgery. Is it invasive? Is it painful? Just para may idea lang tayong lahat. Okay, so LASIK, it means laser in cytokeratomeriosis. Mm-hmm. Medyo no split. Oh. <laughs> but <na> basically, <laughs> it is the most common eye procedure done worldwide. Mm-hmm. It's very common. It's done worldwide. The good thing about LASIK is uh, it's invasive, but it's minimally invasive. No? Okay. We just touch the surface of your eye. We don't go deep. No? Okay. So, wala yung mga kinatatakot ni Sanya na or nating lahat na blindness. No? Uh-huh. There are no recorded case of blindness. No? for a LASIK procedure, no? So, it's a very safe, precise, and effective treatment for mm-hmm. those who are wearing glasses and mm-hmm. contact lenses. Mm-hmm. So, Doc, ang dami kasi na gusto nila magpa-LASIK, but then, ang ginagawa nila, they search for videos on YouTube of the procedure. Kasi yeah. minsan, kapag yun ang una mo nakita, you get uh, intimidated. Kasi makita mo, like, the, really, the eyes, Eye. parang may kinakaskas or something. Doc, paano ba ang procedure nito? Well, the procedure is basically very simple lang, no? We make sure first that you are qualified for the mm-hmm. procedure. So, we do a screening, no? We do a comprehensive screening test, no? We are Shinagawa, kayong dalawa, di ba, ng LASIK? Very lucky tayo na sa Shinagawa ng LASIK because our screening tests here are talagang ad- advanced, no? It's uh, top of the line. And whatever our branches in Japan has, we also have it here in the Philippines. No, talagang very advanced. No, to make sure na the grade that you have, we will correct it here. No, mm-hmm. we will do justice. No, to your grade. No, and you will be normal during the operation. We make sure that you're comfortable. No? Mm-hmm. You can see our clinics. Ang ganda, no? uh, very uh, what you call this enticing. No? Mm-hmm. Technique yan na sinagawa para relax kayo. No? Mm-hmm. Pangalawa, we make sure na you are completely anesthetized. No? So, talagang walang pain. No? Alam niyo yan guys, may yes. mga drops na pinapasang sa inyo. No? So, Sanya, I believe last year? Last year. But, so, kamusta? Was it painful? Kasi it's one thing to hear it from a doctor, yeah. someone from Shinagawa. But yeah. ikaw, you experienced it firsthand. How was it like? As in, sobra, pagpasok pa lang dito, totoo yung sinabi ni Doc. As in, mafe-feel mo talagang Technique dapat. Technique namin yan. Technique oh. namin. Com- comfortable na agad and of course yung mga staff nila dito sobrang bait at ipapafeel nila sa'yo na okay lang yan mabilis lang yung procedure mm-hmm. kaya hindi rin ako kinabahan and sinabi naman kasi nila talagang painless yung surgery uh-huh. and um, actually yun naman yung nangyari nung during the surgery na total lang niya both eyes is 8 minutes ganun mm-hmm. lang siya kabilis siguro ang pinakamatagal mo lang dito is yung Screening, mm-hmm. yun lang talaga para She's i-check kung oh, qualified ka nga or hindi para i-surgery. Yeah. Tsaka maganda, we, the clients or the patients, are well informed. They explain yeah. everything. Thing. You're free to ask anything, ba? And then, so yun na, we had our surgery. Doc, yeah. 
post op eto na, de ba? Kasi sometimes sa kalan natin when you're done with surgery, okay, okay ka na. na. Okay na talaga. Your eyes are parang good as new. So, kailangan malaman din ng ating viewers ano yung mga expectations after the surgery, how to maintain that bright, clear vision, and ano ba yung mga management after. Mm, Doc, okay. alam ko pa sagot ka na. Oh, okay. Pero, <laughs> konting rest muna oh. tayo. Again, para sa ating mga viewers dyan, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to type in sa chat box natin on YouTube and on Facebook. At susubukan natin sagutin yan isa-isa. Dito lang yan sa Shinagawa TV. Welcome back to Shinagawa TV and now it is time to talk about post-LASIK treatment care and recovery. So with us is Doc Alex and Ms. Sanya Lopez. Hello everyone. So Doc, yeah. sinabi natin kanina, mabilis the actual procedure. Yes. But then right after the procedure, are you gonna be allowed to go home right after? Mm -hmm. Are you gonna stay? Meron bang observation time? Okay. You know what? The good thing about LASIK surgery is that it has a wow factor. Mm -hmm. For sure, you have experienced this, guys. Mm -hmm. After the LASIK, immediately after, may changes in the vision. Tama? Sobra. Oo na. Lino na agad. But afterwards, syempre, may eye discomfort. Mm -hmm. For sure, you have experienced that. So, around four to six hours na may konting eye discomfort, but nothing that cannot be treated by uh, anti-pain medications. Sa case ko, Doc, Ang ginawa ko lang talaga is ni-rest ko siya yeah. and then natulog lang ako. Pagkagising ko talaga, ibang-iba na siya. Yeah. Ako ang experience ko, Doc, no? Because right after, the day after, you have to go back to Shinagawa yes. for the post-checkup. Ako na yung nag-drive noon. Pero ang maganda kasi, even before the, the, the actual surgery, they give you a kit. Okay. Na nandun lahat. You have certain drops, drops. tatlo yata yun. You have the pain reliever. Pain reliever. Mm -hmm. So, bibigay ka naman ng instructions na kailangan mong gawin. And here in Shinagawa, no, we don't just take care of you before the surgery, during the surgery, but our aftercare is excellent. No? Our... Ay, Paul, Sanya, mm -hmm. can you still remember some of the do's and don'ts right after? Kasi may mga reminders ang doctors na mga pwede or iiwasan muna na nagawin. Tinanong ko rin kasi, mahilig rin ako mag-travel no. before. Mm -hmm. So sinabi ko, Doc, possible ba na makapag-travel ako mm -hmm. or makapag-work ako? Sabi ni Doc sa akin, pag sa travel, pwede naman, mm -hmm. pero at least magbigay ka ng two weeks to rest muna or mm -hmm. kung hindi mo naman kailangan talaga, huwag ka muna umalis. Yeah. Hayaan mo muna yung eyes mo. If you have enough time, you can rest. No? But if kailangan, Doc, pag If kailangan, kailangan, pwede naman. No? You ah, can pwede. travel. May mga konting restrictions like swimming, no? Mm -hmm. Swimming oh, din. Uh -huh. Kasi, Doc, yun ang naging problem ko. Mm -hmm. Like, for example, meron akong role na binigyan ako serena. So, hindi uh -huh. naman ako pwede hindi pumunta sa ilalim sa ng ilalim. tubig. One month lang naman sa ano. Mga no? one month. One month rest. lang na bawal mag-swimming. No? Just yes, to make sure that everything is A-OK. -okay, no? But, after that, you can go ahead with your uh, uh, daily activities. Wala nang restrict. Yes, tama Doc. Tapos yung makeup pa. Mm -hmm. Yung makeup. For the ladies. Ang um, natatandaan ko sa sinabi sa akin ni Doc ay pwede akong mag-makeup, mm -hmm. pero wala sa eyes talaga. Avoid mm -hmm. muna yung eyes as much as possible na mag-lip tint ka lang. Kilay. Yan yeah, ang importante. And kilay. <laughs> Because kilay is life, pero LASIK is life. Wow! wow. <laughs> pero Doc, alam ko maraming mga viewers natin maaaring concern nila ito yes. because some OFW or some residing in the provinces, the nearby provinces, yun din yung concern nila. Pwede bang pumunta dyan, tapos makakauwi ba agad? Yeah. Um, and yung travel. So again, we wanna clarify na it's okay. It's okay, no problem. Plane, ship, whatever, okay lang. No? The good thing about uh, our technology here in Shinagawa, no? the flap, it, it heals very fast. Mm -hmm. Doc, may tanong ako kasi naging... Actually, doon ako medyo nagpanik kasi sanay ako na pag sinabi ng director na, Okay, yak. Naiiyak agad ako. Pero merong moment na hindi ako makaiyak kahit ramdam na ramdam ko na after the surgery. Is that normal, Doc? Kind of normal because in LASIK, no, parang we cut some of your nerves. Yeah. Mm -hmm. no? But it recovers after at least two or 
one month, no? Mm -hmm. So, ito na, ang tanong ng taong bayan, do. Yes. How long will the effect of the LASIK last? So, basically, what LASIK do kasi, no? Yung, yung mechanism of treatment ng LASIK, we permanently remove corneal tissues to correct your grade. So, anong ibig sabihin nang? Permanent removal of tissues means permanent correction of your vision. So, mm -hmm. lifetime na po yan. However, no, this is a disclaimer, there are age-related eye problems no, that happens to everyone, whether you had your LASIK or not, that predisposes us to use glasses in the future. Ano yung mga yun? The first one na aabangan natin is what we call presbyopia. So, presbyopia is difficulty reading at near or 14 inches distance. It happens more commonly by 40 years old, but can be as early as 35. May iba, may iba late. Pangalawa is cataract. Have you heard of cataract? Mm -hmm. Yes. May mga relatives na ba kayo? Yes. Nagkaroon cataract. So, yan. Cataract or katarata, nangyayari yan by elderly age, mga 60 years old and above. Mas earlier yan kapag may mga comorbidities siya, such as diabetes or hypertension, medyo mas early mo siya ma ma mangyayari sa'yo. But, mm -hmm. Siyempre, kilala kami sa LASIK, but we are more than just LASIK. Yes. We are a refractive center and we do so much more. So, mm -hmm. uh, if you have problems, what, regardless of the age, gender, come here and we'll check you and we'll make sure that there's a treatment option available. Mm -hmm. So now it's time to answer yung mga questions ng mga viewers natin. This time coming from Instagram naman. Yes, Question doc, yeah. I am diabetic. Can I do LASIK? Well, yes, you can, but it's very important that we screen you first. No? Mm -hmm. Because uh, diabetic is very tricky. Yan, no? It causes a different kind of problem. No? So we ha just have to make sure that your diabetes is in control and wala pa siyang effect sa mata mo. Next question ko, is it true that you cannot wear contact lenses anymore after LASIK? Okay, yeah. okay, guys. Oh, kailangan ko naman yun. Ako, oh. actually, yun yung tanong ko talaga. Ah, talaga. Kasi, Sample. Doc, ano eh, lalo na pag may pictorial ka, mm. oh, di ba? Oh. Wala namang problem, no? You can always no, wear contact lenses. No problem with that. Gano'n katagal, yeah. Doc? Be, uh, right right okay, after? Okay lang. Oh. Uh, Right after, the, right right after the, surgery. the surgery? Hindi naman. Siguro after a month. So, good news yan. Lalo na sa mga gusto mag-contact lens pa for aesthetic reason. So, next question, Doc. Is it advisable to undergo LASIK if I have thin corneas? Kasi isa to sa mga chinecheck, diba? Mm. So, thin corneas, no? Again, it's a tricky question, no? Yes, no? Pero may reservations. Mm -hmm. So, again, no? It's very important for us to check you, no? Tingnan natin yung mata mo. Tingnan natin kung pasaba. But the good thing about Shinagawa, no, eh, yabang ko lang. No? Mm -hmm. Here at Shinagawa, no, we use the most advanced uh, LASIK system. No? In other centers, kasi they use microkeratome so, no? or blade no? to cut the flap. No? So in microkeratome, kasi it's a lot more thicker, no? around siguro 140 to 160 microns. But in Shinagawa, we use Femto Second Assisted Laser to create our flap. So, anong ibig sabihin nun? It's much more uh, thinner. No? We can customize it as much as we want. No? Especially for those with very thin corneas, pwede namin nipisan. And again, no, yung mantra namin sa LASIK surgery, no? uh, we remove tissues. So, it's very important that after we remove tissues, we have adequate tissue left in our cornea. Mm -hmm. no? So, with our advanced system here, we can preserve tissue. And that wraps up our questions from our social media. But before I let you go, Sanya, mm -hmm. can you tell us your overall LASIK journey and would you say na it's worth it here in Shinagawa? Naku, sinasabi ko sa'yo, Apple. Sobrang grabe talaga. Yung na-experience ko dito, after nung surgery, Parang life-changing talaga siya kasi pag mo pa nga lang sa umaga, like kinabukasan, grabe na talaga parang totoo ba yung nakikita ko? Totoo ba? Parang pinapakaramdaman mo talaga lahat, na na-appreciate mo yung lahat kasi nga HD na siya. So ang swerte namin ni Sanya kasi kami, we chose Shinagawa and we had our treatment done here. Pero Doc, para sa mga may duda pa, para sa lahat ng may concerns pa, Bakit Shinagawa? Why have their LASIK treatment done here? First and foremost, uh, it actually warms my heart no, to hear no, your testimonies about your LASIK experience. No? As an eye doctor, it makes me feel good. No? Because yan yung gusto namin mangyari. We want to make ano, vision clearer for everyone. So, why Shinagawa LASIK and Aesthetic Center? Well, first and foremost, as a LASIK patient, 
you have to be very mindful, no? Where will I, you know, get my treatment, no? You have to be smart. Mm -hmm. So, LASIK, Shinagawa, you know, the eye center of choice that you should, you know, you should pick should be reputable, no? It should have uh, world-class equipments, machines, and lastly, it should have a good track record. No? You're having a first world country procedure here in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. no? Another thing, no, our staff, no, our medical staff, they're equipped no? with the knowledge and skill no? that needed for this kind of uh, procedure. So you can definitely expect excellence no? in your treatment. And of course, siempre, not only that, no, we take care of our patients. That's our number one priority. With that, nice nati pasalamatan again, Doc Alex sa Gonzales and Ms. Sanya Lopez. Thank you. Finally, Doc, kung meron silang yes. iba pang mga tanong, if our viewers want to consult, get in touch yeah. with you, how can they reach you, Doc? Well, you can reach me here at Shinagawa Lisik and Aesthetic Center. So, I'm actually one of the resident doctors in Makati in Ortiga. So, you, you can contact our trunk line uh, for all your eye concerns. Mm -hmm. Sanya, yung mga fans mo, saan ba nila ikaw pwede mapanood? Ano yung mga dapat abangan? Yes, pero bago yan, gusto ko lang na magpasalamat sa Shinagawa TV for having me here at uh, marami ako natutunan. Thank you, Doc. Thank you, no Miss Apple. At yan po, maraming maraming salamat po sa lahat ng tumutok at sumabaybay ng first tiyaya at sa araw-araw na pagpapatrending niyo sa amin. Maraming maraming salamat po talaga. Sumabaybay lang kayo every Monday to Friday po yan, 7.15 p.m. Pagkatapos po ng 24 oras. Ayan, palapakan naman natin ang ating mga guests again. Thank you very much, you. Doc you. Alex, Ms. Sanya on behalf of Shinagawa TV. And hopefully, uh, you can join us again next time. Yes, sana. <laughs> Ayan sa ating mga viewers, maraming maraming salamat for joining us in today's episode. And in just a little while, we will be flashing on the screen the winners para sa ating raffle. Alright? There you have it. My name is Apple David, giving you this reminder. You can achieve that freedom and independence from glasses and contact lenses here at Shinagawa LASIK and Aesthetic Center. Good day, happy Independence Day everyone!